Welcome, this is Jeff with Armadillo Pepper. Today we're going to grill portobello mushrooms and stuff them with sausage, mozzarella cheese, and jalapenos. This makes for an awesome meal all to itself. Now what you'll need to do this are two large portobellos. You can see I can uh, barely stretch my fingers across these. These are uh, six, seven inches across. You'll need one and a half cups of shredded mozzarella cheese a half a cup of sausage, ground sausage, half a cup of white onion. Here I have six red grape tomatoes that I've just quartered. We've got one green jalapeno, we removed the seeds, diced it up, and then I've got about a third, it doesn't have to be exact, but about a third of a red bell pepper uh, diced up. A couple tablespoons of olive oil, and three tablespoons of cilantro. Now what we're going to do is put the portobellos on the grill. I've got it heating here at about medium high. We're going to cook them about five minutes each. Let me also get the pan going here for the sausage. While the portobello mushrooms are cooking on the grill, softening up, get a nice grill flavor to them, I'll be cooking the sausage. Once the sausage is cooked, then we're going to make the stuffing and stuff the portobellos and finish them off on the grill. Let's, uh, before we get going, you want to put some olive oil on these guys. Stop them from drying out. And I'd recommend you do both sides. Again, we have the grill here on about medium heat. We're going to let these guys uh, cook for, oh, three, four, five minutes. I'll keep an eye on them. Let's get our sausage uh, going here. And what I like to do is just go ahead and cook the sausage and the onions together. Now, what I'm going to do is go ahead and put the tomatoes, the cheese, the green pepper and jalapeno. Then we're going to use two tablespoons of the cilantro. You want to save one tablespoon. We're going to garnish with that. Okay, here. Turn this heat down just a little. Now this dish does have the one jalapeno in it. If you want to make it spicier, you could use uh, habanero. Um, instead of using the third of the red bell pepper, you could use another red jalapeno. The other thing you could do is, you know, you can buy sausage in all types of heat levels. So you could buy a hot or a very hot um, sausage if you're one that really likes it uh, hot. What I've chosen for this sausage is a medium heat. Uh, not everyone in our family uh, prefers the high heat. So we're just going to set these guys aside for a minute until our sausage mixture is ready. All right, so our sausage is ready to go. Now, if you'd like, you can drain this on a paper towel just to get any excess grease off. This looks like a pretty lean sausage, but there's not much grease. Now, 
Okay. I'm going to turn my grill down now to, uh, let's say, about medium, medium low. I'm going to put each of these portobellos back on here. You want to then put your sausage in with the rest of your mixture. Give it a good uh, thorough mixing. Okay, and uh, just spoon it on here. I actually got enough here probably to do this. four portobellos, so what the heck. Now what we're going to do is just put the lid down on it. Let it sit here for, oh, maybe three minutes, maybe five minutes, just to get that cheese nice and All right, we're ready to plate these up. Easier said than done. And then what I've done here is also grilled a couple of pineapple pieces with a little pepper jelly to serve these with. Then we're going to take the cilantro, a little garnish there. Oh, okay. And there you have it. It's just that easy. That's grilled portobello mushrooms with mozzarella, jalapenos, and ground sausage. Yeah, my name is Jeff. I'm with Armadillo Pepper. You can check us out at armadillopepper.com or see what we're up to over on Facebook.